So yeah. one more way of joining things together is with slots. So you can see here that you can make a solid object like that from these two pieces here. So I'll just show you how to do that. So you need two pieces of cardboard. These can be any size and they can be a lot bigger and they can be different shapes, but I'm just using squares for now to keep it simple for the explanation. So you'll need a ruler and a pen. Now your slot can be at any point. It's better to, for it to be near the middle, but it's not essential, it's exactly in the middle. The only key is for it not to be too close to the edge because if it's too close to the edge, it might rip and then the, the object won't hold together very well. If you use a, a ruler, you want your line that you're drawing to go halfway the distance. So this piece of card for me is 14 centimeters wide, so I'm gonna draw my line seven centimeters in. So I've got that there. And I want to do exactly the same thing on the other piece. So you can see I've definitely not drawn them in the middle. <laughs> but we can get, grab a pair of scissors and you want to cut down. Now you can see that this pen's quite wide. So rather than just doing one cut, you want to do two, but you don't want to do them very, very far apart, as you'll see in a minute. So you want to cut down. So you'll have this little bit here. Now, can you be a bit careful here? It doesn't have to be perfect, but if you use the scissors and take that bit off. And you do the same. There we go. And once you've got your two pieces, what you want to do is line them up like this at right angles and push them together. It's important that both the slots are the same on each piece of cardboard and that they are half the width of this and I'll show you why that that's important now so let's just pretend that you did this one a bit bigger so you can see now I've got one that's much bigger than the other and when I put them together you end up with a shape like this where they're not not even so when I put it down it's gonna wobble so you might actually want that so if you want that <laughs> in a model, then it's quite useful. But if you want them to be even like this so that it's nice and strong, make sure that you do the cuts the same size.